Today, guys, we're going to be doing a custom build for the brand new Weevil Custom in GTA Online. Now, a little while ago, I did just upgrade this car, and I just made it look crazy and cool, but this car is actually incredible and has some amazing customizations available for it. You might remember in that video, I dragged race somebody at the airport with it, and bro, his car looked phenomenal. So, we are going to be making a replica of his car, whoever that was in that video. If you ever see this video, huge shout out to you because your customization is absolutely fire. Anyways, we're going to recreate this right now in GTA 5, so I hope you go on to enjoy, and let's get this thing going and start upgrading this beautiful vehicle. So, on the front, I don't think this actually had anything. I think he left the front completely stock. I think he left this stock too. I might toss on the tusks though. Just for a little bit of, like, I don't know, just a little wow factor. I don't know. I'm just going to say it's a clean build except for these exhaust pipes. Because end of the day, you need to put these on. Like, these ones just look like shit. I'm not putting that on. I'm not putting that on. Not, no. Just, just no. Just definitely not. None of these. This is the best one. This has to go on. So I think we're going to keep this casual and actually go with some nice red custom fog lights once again. But we're not going to make them xenon. I think we're going to go with blue custom fog lights on this. Because the color itself is going to be like a bluish purple. So uh, we'll see, we'll see. Um, for the front, now here. Now here's a real question. Do we toss something on here? That's that's a question. We could add some horns. Okay, you know, maybe we'll just add some trim. I think we're just going to add the chrome trim. For the hood itself, for now I'm going to toss that on. Even though it looks really weak. No, we're going to take it right off. Never mind. Uh, I don't think there's anything good to put on for the hood options. Except this in a way. But still, no. Nah, hood options are just kind of not it. Roll cage, we're going to put the full cage in. For the lights, we're not going to change the headlights at all. For the livery, now this guy, this guy tossed this shit on. Where is it? Where is it? Right here. Purple flames. Bro, this shit looks so damn clean. Uh, we're going to toss... Oh, oh, those are sick-ass mirrors. Those are actually sick. Skeletal mirrors. I think we're just going to toss on... Let's toss on some old-school mirrors. Ornaments, we're going to go with the hot rod skull mount once again. Plate, yellow on black, respray. We're going to change the color after because we're going to mess with it a bit. Now on the roof, I still kind of want to put the spikes on. I still do. To make it match though, we're going to put this one on. The spikes would look proper on the roof and on the hood. That's the thing. It would look clean. Uh, for this, we're going to go with the primary running boards. Sun strips, we're going to just toss on a primary one. Yeah, we don't need a visor or anything like that. Spoiler, we're once again going with the GT wing because it's clean as fuck. Suspension, sport suspension, of course. Race transmission, turbo tuning, wheels, we will mess with outside, and window limo tint. Okay, beautiful. All we need to do now is mess with the wheels and the color. Okay. So this guy had some beautiful Benny's rims on there. No, he had, where are they? I know they're Benny's. They are clean right here. It's these wheels right here. Oh, yes. Wheel color. I'm pretty sure he had something along the lines of that slate blue. Then for the paint, we're going to be putting on a custom midnight purple. So here is regular midnight purple. Oh, that looks clean. That looks clean the way it is. You honestly don't even need to change that. Bro, I'm liking that. I'm liking that. Oh, that is nice. Even the regular hot rod flames are nice, bro. A lot of li every livery goes with this. Bro, they all look clean. Look at that with this. Oh, sheesh. That's nice. Oh, man. These are so clean. The, these, these two liveries don't go with it. This one is pretty decent. That one is pretty nice. I think we're going to go with this one still. All right. So we're going to spice this up a little bit, I think. Now that we got the wheels and the paint corrected. Might even change the wheels, to be honest. Uh, hood accessories. I think we're actually going to go with spikes on the hood. I think we're going with spikes on the hood. Just like that. Spice it up a little bit. You know what I mean, bro. That's looking nice. I'm not 100% sure if this is exactly what he had on the car or not. But even a shaft or purple right there. Right there, that's nice. Midnight purple even. I think we might go with that. I'm liking that. That is what I call a hot rod. God damn, this thing is looking nice. Now, if you really wanted to, let's make it a bit brighter outside here. Now, of course, we have a midnight purple on here normally. So, if you want, you can make the midnight purple a bit nicer. Primary color, set RGB. We're going to change the RGB value to 30. And then we're going to change the secondary color RGB value also to 30. Was that a dubsta 2 that just drove? That was literally a dubsta 2 that just drove by. Um, but that, there we go. Now we got like a, a, a little bit lighter of a midnight purple. You know what I mean? Like, it's looking clean now. I like that look. 
Might even change the wheels up. Might even change the wheels up. Let me take a look at this. Like, even these... Ah, uh, nah. I don't know. I don't think... I don't know if I'm feeling the white walls now. Sometimes just picking the wheels is one of the hardest parts. I'm not gonna lie. It becomes very difficult to find, like, the perfect wheels that fit the car so well. Like, he, he really did make a nice build. When you add the spikes to it and everything, too. Oh, and of course, you gotta add those beautiful exhausts. Look at that. Bro, and this car is so damn fast. There we go. Miles per hour. Okay, let's take a look at this. I know we're downhill, but still. Here we go. Zero to 100. Look at the zero to 60. Zero to 100 in no time, bro. This car flies. When I say you guys need to buy it for drag racing, I mean you need to buy it. That speed is legit too. Like, this car is crazy. Look at this. I have no mods on. No acceleration mods. And this thing just flies like crazy, guys. The braking is shit, though. I will give you that. The braking is garbage. It is way too damn fast. Like, incredibly fast. Holy. Anyways, comment down below what you guys think of this custom build. Like I said, this is not my build. When that guy pulls up and he wanted to race, bro, I, I fell in love with that build. And I had to share it with you guys. It looks phenomenal. Props to you, whoever you are. Your build for this car was absolutely flawless. I love the look of it. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching the video. Comment down below if you bought this car. And if you did buy it, what do you think of it? But anyways, thank you so much for watching the video, and with that said, I will catch you guys in the next one.